Hey everybody, welcome to Medley World. Today, we're at Typhoon Lagoon. Come on in, check it out. That's right everybody. Typhoon Lagoon is now reopened. It just reopened last week. Um, it had been closed down during the winter time. What Disney usually does is, in the winter, they usually run water one water park. Now in the summer, prior to the pandemic, what would happen is usually March around spring break, which was last week here in Florida, um, they would open both the water parks. But like I said, during the winter, they would kind of rotate seasonally between either Blizzard Beach would be open for several months with Typhoon Lagoon closed, or they would reverse that order and ha have Typhoon Lagoon open and Blizzard Beach closed for the winter. But since pandemic times, oh, big waves. Since pandemic times, they've only been running one kind of alternating. So I'm curious to see if this summer, if they are going to open both, but I just kind of want to give you that information. So right now there's usually one open at a time, basically is the point. And it's Typhoon Lagoon, which just opened to Blizzard Beach. I don't know when it's going to reopen guys. Hopefully soon, so we'll, you could have a pick between the two. Anyway, this, is why I love Typhoon Lagoon. It's the wave pool. You can see it's really, really big and it has those big, giant waves. There's no other wave pool like that in all of Orlando. This wave pool is kind of unique in that sense that, yeah, there's plenty of wave pools. You go to a water park, you're gonna have wave pools. But this one has the big waves. I know I love it. Jake loves it, Roberta loves it. A lot of times we just come in the afternoon we hang out and just kind of come in here for a couple hours so i'm gonna try to get out in the water a little bit and show you the impact of those big waves if you have glasses or a hat you better hang on tight because that wave will it'll it'll take them right off matter of fact i think i'm gonna go put my glasses and hat away so i can get you out there i got the gopro i'll get you right in the waves with me all right guys here it comes we're gonna go under together here it comes get ready Like I said, and then it goes crashing against the surf up top, the rocks and everything. You can see it splashing up. Ah. Guys, that's what's so cool about this. Ah, I love it. I love it. Ooh, just kind of really wanted to give you an up close shot so you guys can really see how big those waves are. Now they also have life vests. I'll show you when I get out. They do have life vests. If you're not a strong swimmer, I would highly recommend you wear that if you want to enjoy those waves because they come in hard and they come in heavy. They have a lot of energy behind them. So, you see what I mean? Why it's so fun. And also, all the water's heated here. So if you're coming on a day, which probably won't happen much now because we're getting into April, but coming on a day that's maybe a little bit cooler out the water will be heated it'll be warm Whew, that was fun i'll try to do one more see i'm trying to back up a little bit and this time i'll try to stay above the wave but back up so you can really see how it comes in so let me see if it'll work uh as soon as the wave comes i'll turn that camera back on uh instead of dipping under this time i'll kind of stay above it and it'll be broken by the time it gets here so you can just see another kind of perspective from, you know, it's a little bit shallower here, uh, but you'll still see that force of that wave coming in. You can see it building. I'm gonna try to stay above this one. At least I'll try to hold the camera up. Let's see what happens. You guys ready? Look at the force coming in. Couldn't do it. It got me. That's what I'm telling you. I love it guys, I hope you're enjoying this on Medley World today. We're having a good time. Guys, please take a moment, subscribe to Medley World if you haven't yet, if you're enjoying this vlog. Uh, that was fun, so you guys can really see that force. I can't wait to see what that looked like. I think I did like a 360 almost under the water. Ah, a lot of fun though. Let me catch my breath. Ah, so what'd you guys think of the wave pool? I told you. <laughs> Those waves, man, they had a lot of fun, man. We love to hang out in those waves. Let me show you something cool, too. I'm kind of standing up here above the wave pool. And over here they have, which is really neat, because, you know, you think about family and you think about hanging out. 
if you're an adult, you can hang out kind of in this area, and your kids can use this slide. This slide, I believe, is uh, is a height requirement, but you have to be under a certain height. Looking over, it looks like it's 50 inches, I think, so you got to be pretty short to use that one, which is pretty neat, though, because, like I said, you can hang out. They come right down here, and there's a wave pool, so pretty cool. Also want to let you guys know I have a full tour of this entire Tycoon Lagoon water park. I walked the whole perimeter of this park. Uh, I show you all the different slides, the uh, a lot of the requirements, and just kind of gives you a good look around just to see if it's something you're interested in. Uh, I'll put a link to that in the description of the video. Um, right now, I actually want to show you guys, like I said, I have all that information. I have several of the entities made, so aren't they so awesome? That's a real nice shot. Yeah, look at that. But like I said, I have several different vlogs here from Typhoon Lagoon, but I wanted to come today to show you that, yeah, it's open, ready to go. Uh, I want to head over, though. One thing I have never done here is show you guys the, mer the merch. They have really cool merch here. I believe they have a sunglass hut. Let me go over there and show you guys the merch. Because we're heading over to see the merch. I just kind of want to give you a little bit of the idea of the theming. The theming here at Typhoon Lagoon is exactly that. It was kind of like this beautiful island you were on, like a resort island, and you could hang out, and it was tropical and beautiful. And then a typhoon came in, and it brought in all kinds of things, as I just showed you. Now there's a ship stuck up in the mountains. The clock tower up here all broken up and leaning, but that clock is very useful when you're in the wave pool. And as you go around, you'll see kind of like driftwood and surfboards that have been beaten up. So um we're here on the island after the typhoon still beautiful and gorgeous but it was hit and it was hit hard so that's kind of like the theming and i did want to show you guys those life jackets uh as we head over to the merch let me find them and show you you will find these racks of all of these life jackets if you need them they're scattered throughout the park they're all over so usually when you come to an attraction uh you'll you'll find those like i said there's a station here also over the other side you might be able to see them a little bit there's another station over there so especially over here by the wave pool but you will find them as you're walking through if you need one usually not too far away you'll be able to get a life jacket if you're uh they look kind of small though don't they? i thought they had bigger ones maybe not but definitely if your child is not a strong swimmer plenty of life jackets now let's head over and check out the merch as we're heading over there guys just kind of walk and talk with you that's how we like to do our vlogs i hope you're enjoying meddling worlds uh if it's the first time you're watching i usually have roberta who's my wife and my son jake with us when we go on our adventures there are there are times when i just go out and make vlogs on my own because of schedules right so today i'm solo um and when i talk about stuff or give you guys information i kind of like to walk around and do it like you're hanging out with us that's how i make the vlog just like you you're hanging out and you're on the adventure so if you haven't seen the full tour yet so let's see behind me the big wave pool we just we just walked over the lazy river they also have like lockers here restrooms when you come in and then the merchandise right here so and you can see that exit sign so that's where you would exit the park and also come in that way so let's take a look inside here i'll just keep it rolling you're on the adventure again oh look at this mickey umbrella that's cool man and i'm just going to kind of highlight the merch just to show you the different things they have they do have actually beach toys here um again themed just like you're at the beach right some of the toys and they do have a sunglass hut here as well so if you have your ray bands or anything you need even a adjusting type they take care of that in there too i've done it before got some of our towels here's a blizzard beach towel actually that's the other water park blizzard beach and the typhoon lagoon with stitch different towels so and of course the Swim shirts, UV shirts, love those. Blizzard Beach, well, they're getting rid of some Blizzard Beach stuff over here at Typhoon Lagoon. Um, in Typhoon Lagoon, you'll find a lot with the stitch. All right, there he is. Blizzard Beach too, if I remember right. Blizzard Beach has stitch on it. So 
So they have some of the kids' stuff. Here's a water bottle. That's pretty cool. Bathing suit. So, you know, if you came down, plenty of bathing suits, all different sizes, too. They have youth, uh, adult. Pretty neat. Hats, bags. I will say that the retail at Blizzard Beach, the store at Blizzard Beach is a lot bigger than this. They have a lot more to choose from over at Blizzard Beach. And over here, I always like to show the towels because I love how they display the towels. They just have them up there and then you can see exactly what they look like. So we'll kind of walk through there so you guys can see. There's the Typhoon Lagoon right there. And that must be Blizzard Beach, I'm assuming. And the towels, 30. And then they have just some regular Disney stuff too. They have Crocs. So everything you kind of need. Uh, also they have, I think they have sunscreen and stuff. I thought I just walked by. Let me see if I can find that as we go. We even have some pins, different pins. So a little bit of everything. You guys want snacks. And they have quite a variety of food here too. They have adult beverage. They have, oh, if you have a popcorn bucket, uh, you can do your refills here. It's like $2.25, I think, for a refill. The water park, I think, for some reason, is $2.35. I don't know why. I think that's accurate, though. More sandals. <clears throat> so just kind of walking through the store with you guys. Different sandals, Javianas. You can tell by looking there. And more. Matter of fact, Jake has this uh, shirt. It's a UV shirt. It has this exact same one that I got. If you guys watch the Blizzard Beach merch, that's where I got it. And men's trunks. There you go. Let me just take a look, guys. I do want to see. If I can find like the suntan lotion and stuff like that. There's plenty of suntan lotion as well. And beverage. I believe they also, I don't know if they rent towels or you can complimentary. I'm going to see if I can find that out for you too. So if you're staying at a resort, I don't think you have to bring your towel in. Let me see if I can find out the information about the towels. Because as you can see, let me show you. I can see them all stacked up. So I just got to find out. I'm gonna ask cast member like all right. I got the information on the towels So if you're staying on Disney property in one of the Disney resorts, you can come in and you can use the towels complimentary If you're on an out, outside area uh, Resort that isn't see you later Sean. You later. Have a good day brother If you're uh, Staying out off Disney property and you come in you can use the towel for two dollars and then return it You return them at the end of the day. You'll see you usually have a bin out there so I've seen that bin before, and you just throw them in there. So there's your information. $2 if you're off property to use. If you're on property, complimentary return at the end of the day. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed our vlog here today from Typhoon Lagoon. Again, if you're interested, I have several vlogs from Typhoon Lagoon. Check out the one of the tour all around. It'll give you all the information, including the kids' area here. So, uh, Lazy River different slides that's a real good one to check out so thank you so much for watching please take a moment subscribe to meddling world if you have not yet thank you to our patreons and last but not least see ya